Morning, a police chase ends in a crash in the Allied Gardens area. Police say it all started when a Jeep ran a red light around 3.30 this morning when they tried to pull the driver. Brody swerving off the pills. See them blue and red lights coming over hills. Handgun and busted headlight, rolling for the thrills. Should he surrender or fuck around and just get killed? Bluebird struck the line, like now he on prime time. Bust a left at the next turn and stay up out of sight. Hop up out the whip, my nigga, and just fucking dip. Brody got too much adrenaline from drilling shit. Brody talking hella reckless, he went kill a pig. Dropped his niggas off and fucked around. To spin the beans. Next morning, heard the ops called him at the station. Deep down, all them niggas knew he wasn't gonna make it. Couple weeks ago, he left up on that pavement. Ride his sister, boyfriend, he linked with Jamaicans. Got the word, tried to change his life. But did he know he was on his last light? Apple tracker, supposed to case you, he in plain sight. And that's when bro jumped out with that fucking chunky pipe. Let off 50 shots and then he slid off to the night. But what they didn't know was Brody was the uncover type. Next morning, he woke up, seen the boyfriend fighting life. Treacherous in the hood, you either leave her. Treacherous in the hood, you either leave her. Whoa. Treacherous in the hood, you either leave her. Whoa. Driving on the wrong side of the road at one point. That Jeep ended up crashing into another car at Waring Road and Zion Avenue. Two suspects were taken into custody, including a 16 year old.